One of the major functions of RBI is to control inflation and liquidity in the economy. Today I am going to discuss about various tools with RBI that directly impacts the money supply in the economy. The first tool is cash reserve ratio. CRR is a certain percentage of total bank deposits that has to be kept in the current account with RBI. This is the money that commercial banks need to keep with RBI. The impact of increased CRR Positive impact It is a quick fix to control inflation. By increasing CRR, commercial banks need to deposit more money with RBI. Thus, commercial banks left with less money. Now loans become dearer so people have less money. As less money with commercial banks leads to less money with people. It leads to lower demand for goods and services which ultimately leads to lower prices. Simply, higher CRR sucks the money from the economy. The impact of decreased CRR More money with commercial banks leads to more money with people which leads to higher demand for goods and services which leads to higher prices. CRR should be aligned with supply and production levels. If people are producing more, then they deserve to spend more. Decreased CRR provides a short term fix as it increases demand for short term. Statutory Liquidity Ratio or SLR This is the percentage of liabilities and time deposits that commercial bank need to keep with them in form of cash, gold or government approved securities. Impact of increase in SLR Commercial banks need to keep more liquid funds which leads to less loans to people which leads to lower demand for goods and services which leads to lower prices. Impact of decrease in SLR Commercial banks need to keep less liquid funds which leads to more loans to general people which leads to higher demand for goods and services and which ultimately leads to higher prices. The next tool is Repo and Reverse Repo Rates. Repo Rate It is the rate at which RBI lends money to commercial banks against securities. Commercial banks go to RBI or the central bank whenever there is a shortage of funds. The Reverse Repo Rate Reverse repo rate is a short term borrowing rate at which RBI borrows money from commercial banks. What's the impact? If commercial banks get more money then they will lend more money to people which will lead to more demand in the economy. Thus prices will increase. The next tool is bank rate. It is a rate at which RBI lends money to commercial banks without any security. Impact What is the impact of bank rate? When bank rate is increased, interest rate also increases, which have negative impact on demand. Thus, prices increases. The next tool and the very important tool is marginal standing funding. By this mechanism, commercial banks can get loans from RBI for their emergency needs. Commercial banks can take loan only up to 1% of their liabilities and time deposits. Open Market Operations Open Market Operations refers to the buying and selling of government securities in the open market in order to expand or contract the amount of money in the banking system. The Impact of Purchasing the Securities more money in the economy leads to more demand which ultimately leads to higher growth rate. The impact of selling of government securities. It leads to less money in the economy which leads to less demand of goods and services which ultimately leads to lower prices in the economy. So that, that's all for today. 
आई होप यू लाइक दिस वीडियो प्लीज सब्सक्राइब टू आर चैनल लाइक दिस वीडियो कॉमेंट ऑन दिस वीडियो इन केस यू लाइक दिस वीडियो प्लीज मेक अ कॉमेंट इफ यू वॉन्ट टू गिव अ फीडबैक द फीडबैक इज वेरी इंपॉर्टेंट फॉर अस प्लीज गिव योर फीडबैक इन द कॉमेंट सेक्शन आई विल रिप्लाई ऑल द कॉमेंट्स थैंक यू